Governor Michelle Lujan Grisham just announced we will be easing into the first phase of reopening. She's been a bit slower than other governors around the country to reopen. Here's News 13, Stephanie Chavez. 32 states have reopened, including Texas, where restaurants can have dine-in customers, people can go shopping in person, and movie theaters are open, all at limited capacity. New Mexico, however, is one of nine states in the soft reopening phase. Today, Governor Michelle Lujan Grisham uh, announced that soft reopening, but she is still encouraging people to stay at home as much as possible. We're going to continue to prohibit congregating in large groups and, la and numbers of people. So we're going to keep that tight and small. We're going to be in our bubbles of, of uh, 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 four in yourself, so five. Governor Michelle Lujan Grisham put the stay at home order in place on March 19th. Today, she announced that small retailers can operate at 25% capacity. Movie theaters, concert halls, and amusement parks, however, will remain closed. Churches will also be allowed to operate at 10% capacity. Sky News captured video this morning of light traffic on the freeways, empty parking lots, and an airport that looks more like a ghost town. We spoke to a few people today who say they're tired of the stay at home order, but they understand its importance. I think I understand where, um, you know, the safety of like everyone is, you know, really, really important. Um, obviously, like being a recent grad and uh, not being able to celebrate with my friends and being able to really just have a um, kind of an end to this book um, kind of stinks. I think if you don't have any old people in your house, uh, you should definitely be able to go outside and do stuff. But if if you personally can affect the elderly, you should definitely be more cautious. While traffic paints an image that people are staying home based on cell phone data, the New York Times estimates 60% of New Mexicans were venturing out of their homes a couple of weeks ago. The Times estimates that number was up to 65% last week. Now, in that same study, Arizona was the state with the least number of people venturing out of their homes. The governor of Arizona says his state will be opening up on Friday. Back to you. All right, thank you, Stephanie. New Mexico is middle of the road in confirmed cases per capita compared to other states, but more than half of our cases are in two counties, McKinley and San Juan. The state auditor says he's ready to subpoena.